Hi, we're at the 2025 Paris Air Show on the booth of General Atomics. We are with Johnny King, Vice President of General Atomics UK, to discuss the MQ-9B Advanced Early Warning. It is a new product that GA is launching here at Paris this week. Johnny, good morning. Thanks for welcoming us. Hello, how are you? I'm great, thank you. So, uh, well, please tell us about your new product you have here. Uh, yes, we've been developing an AEW capability with Saab. Saab are one of the leaders in, um, in airborne early warning and control. And we are taking their radar, their AESA radar, putting it into our pods, one under each wing, looking outwards, and a central pod that, keep, that controls all of, the, uh, all of the common avionics for the two. And that pod uh, brings airborne early warning to our MQ-9B and the new MQ-9B stole for the navies that do not have uh, catapults and traps. You have a nice uh, poster on your booth showing uh, one of the Queen Elizabeth class uh, carrier with uh, this aircraft with the stole uh, kit and the AEW pods. Uh, are you specifically marking this to the Royal Navy? Uh, Royal Navy is one of our lead customers interested in this capability. They currently have a helicopter based airborne early warning system called Crow's Nest and they are looking to replace that capability by the end of the decade. So the airborne early warning that we can bring with the MQ-9B stole is definitely of interest to them. But there are other customers interested from the Navy side, Italy, uh, Japan and Spain, some of those. How uh, does this aircraft with those pods compare to with uh, legacy uh, AWACS aircraft like uh, well, E3, uh, E2Ds or Global I? Yeah, it's the same sort of capabilities. In fact, the capability that Saab are developing is a generation on from what they have on Global I. Uh, so it, but it's, but it's going to be a smaller radar, so it does have more limited range in terms of uh, what we're looking at. and. Uh, because it's an unmanned system, uh, we do not have uh, crews that are going forward into the battle space. It also has a much longer endurance, and it is, but it's a smaller radar panel, which gives you less range than, the, than a manned aircraft. All right, Johnny. Thank you very much. Thank you.